Good evening everybody, Andy out here at the Brandon Family Farm. Beautiful, beautiful night. Just fed all the sheep. So they're happy and quiet. A lot of the property dried up the last couple days. Of course, we have a 90% chance of rain tonight. Just waiting on the troughs to fill. Filled the first trough. Filled the second trough. And this is the cow's trough. Got a little bit ways to go. It's getting there though. Looks like we'll have to get some round bells tomorrow and put them in the pen. The grass is starting to grow. I kind of like to keep a little hay on them. You could say I spoil them. I'm a spoiler. They're definitely not without no food. I believe Julie's down there spoiling the dogs right now. And when I say spoil, I mean she spoils them. Hey, Angus. Enjoying your grain? Jenny and Forrest. They're just they're just uh, just about finished up with their grain. They'll be headed down to bully the sheep. Hi, Layla. How you doing, beautiful girl? Julie's hanging out with the dogs. Is she? Yes. I see the blood and I see the oval. Okay. So she's definitely, and he knows it. He knows it. Yeah, he knows all, every time, don't you, Axel? You can see she's really big and she's got blood. Ginger's licking a potato. Ginger got her a potato and she's gonna go sit somewhere and chew on it. She likes potatoes. Hi big boy. He looks so handsome sitting there, don't he? Yeah. Hi <laughs> feller. Is that potato good, Ginger? You guys enjoy. Looks like the cows already took off. Yeah, they cleaned it out. They're gonna go down there and be the cleanup crew for the sheep's troughs now. But don't worry, the sheep definitely get their share. I allow for the cows to come down and bully them a little bit on the trough. And plus the sheep has been pasturing already. They're doing really good. And the lambs are fat and the ewes are fat considering they just had lambs. We're getting ready to wean actually all the lambs. Well, we're getting close. In fact, I 
think I'm going to actually be separating the lambs. And Dorpers can uh, breed all year round. And so we'll separate these and in a month we'll they'll start breeding again. We'll get some fall lambs. Beautiful, beautiful night. Yeah. Now, supposedly, there is some Canadian geese back here sitting on eggs next to the pond oh they're they're just one a possum we'll see if we can find it Dogs are probably going to come up barking thinking I'm a predator. I'm not seeing no Canadians. Usually a male will come after you. They're like guard dogs when it comes to the drakes sitting on the eggs. Well, it could be that I don't see them. It's okay, girls. It's daddy. Good job, though. I built this little hut back here for the cows. They do use it. But for the most part, most of these animals don't even go inside anything. They stand out in the snow, they stand out in the rain. It takes one heck of a storm to get them to go to the lean-tos. Beautiful night. I'm standing in the horse pasture right now. They only bring the horses out just a couple times a week as the grass gets thicker. I imagine they'll bring them out a little more. Howdy, Dorpers. Patches, your two babies is really looking good there. Hatchet and snow, or peaches rather. Doing really good. <laughs> Jasmine and buttons. Yeah. Hi, Romeo. <laughs> yeah, you can't hit me when I'm on this side, can you, buddy? Hi, Annie. There's Jade out there. Hi, Angus. 
How you doing, buddy? You gonna be a daddy pretty soon? Yeah? He's starting to get a nice head on him. And his neck's starting to look good. A nice looking bull. Like I said on the last video, Jenny there, she uh, she's really sticking out on the sides. And we'll just watch and see if she bags up. Well, you guys have a nice night. Got some leftover posts and some fence for some future projects. As it gets warmer. Grass is really starting to come in thick. Well, that's gonna probably do it for the night. This trough should just about be filled. Gives them plenty of water. Oh, that could be a problem. Why it's going so slow. Huh. Well, I'll go shut her down. Because it is starting to get dark and it's time to go home. And get up tomorrow and start this whole process all over again. So thanks for coming with me and, and try to subscribe. We'll see you.